Hi, my name is Dr. Tariq Haki. I'm the Director of Men's Health here at Advanced Urology. I wanted to chat with you quickly about shockwave therapy to the penis. Linear shockwave therapy has been studied in Europe, and there are many exciting studies that are coming out showing the potential benefit. However, there are other therapies out there, like shockwave therapy, that are used for stones. So some people are bringing shockwave machines to the United States and using the shockwave therapies for stones for erectile dysfunction. This is a problem because many of these machines are designed to focus the shock waves to 13 millimeters in focus, when in linear shock wave therapy, the shocks are spread out over a 70 millimeter focus area. Many machines like the Gaines Wave machine, these are focus therapies that are used in orthopedics and also used for kidney stones. However, the Renova machine is one of the machines that has a linear shock wave therapy that spreads the shock out. Currently, this technology is only available through trials. Recently, the Society of Sexual Medicine announced a position statement on erectile dysfunction restorative therapies like shockwave therapy and the platelet-rich plasma proteins. We believe that the current lack of regulatory agency approval for these regenerative therapies means that the treatment of ED using these therapies should be held off unless it's conducted under a research protocols under the compliance of an institutional review board. The SMSNA guidelines stipulate that we should not be using shockwave until it's approved by the FDA and other governing boards, especially due to the fact that we may be getting shockwave through the wrong machine. At Advanced Urology, we follow the SMSNA guidelines and the FDA guidelines. At this point in time, we will begin to use the linear shockwave therapy once we have the correct machine. Thank you.